Same with Jackie. So this is a very awesome gift. Well, we'll see. There's three um, items in here only. One is a gift, and I'm really hoping it's awesome because I bought it for them. <laughs> and I bought, there's only three items in this bag. Well, I think there's only three items in this bag. Let's make sure. There's three items that I remember are in this bag. I'm trying, my, my, my big dog is trying to come help me. No, I have no snacks for you, sir. No, no. Um, I, they've been fine by themselves, but they hear me opening and rustling things. And they're like, oh, is that a treat? No, no, it's not. Not everything plastic is for you. So, okay. So also, <laughs> so you know how I am only been an affiliate or a collaboration with S-Zone Bags? And I've bought a few. They've given me a few. And I found them on Timu. And um, so I'm like, oh, yeah. So it's not the full-blown catalog. It's not. So they have an Amazon store, an online presence, an online shop, an Amazon shop. And then now they have some on Timu. And um, so I said, well, heck, that's clearance prices right there. And I'm pretty sure that's what, they, what they're for is they're. Yes, I got another one. Um, three of these things in here are... So this is a gift. This is one of the ones that are a gift. So this is a... They put a little foam thing so it doesn't crease crease. Actually, it's very clever. Um, so this is just a black leather tote. You will not believe how inexpensive this tote was. This tote... I paid... And it's a gift, so it's still going to a friend of mine. Um... I think eleven dollars, fifteen, maybe fifteen. Um, there and these I've seen them. So this is just pure, just a leather, and it says it's genuine leather. It smells like genuine leather. It doesn't smell like genuine leather. It does look like leather. Um, it says it's leather. It's probably a split. Obviously, it's a split. Actually, it's not that heavy not to be a split, but it's a leather. It's hard to see black on black, but it comes with this interior organizing pouch that has like a leather um, zipper trim. Let's see what it says. Product model, main constituents, ca split cow. So it's split cow. That's what I thought it would be. Split cow, which means it's just a top layer, thin layer of leather. And it's uh, several skin cowhides have different layers. So this is leather. It is a leather bag. It will wear like a leather bag. It has a nylon backing on their straps so that this will give stability and less stretch your arm, your straps on your handles. This will help your bag carry more weight. Um, so this is going to be a gift. I like the way it's finished out. It'll look better once I, once I fluff it up. You know, um, it's just a raw, raw trim, raw edge, very clean. Um, let's see what the actually. Uh, I'm probably gonna give it to her with the very strong magnet. I'm gonna fluff this out for presentation and um, I'm gonna put that in a in my closet for gifting because that, that's perfect for her. She she will love that. She loves um, of totes and that's a leather tote and who doesn't like a tote, you know? So I bought two. One, but I think that one was more expensive because it was black. This one's a little less expensive. And I'm talking like two or three dollars less expensive. So this, SO, this one I got for me. Um, it might go to my sister because she she um she's a school teacher and they live and die by tote bags and she her her uh, school colors are red this is more maroon bordeaux i actually really like this red one better you can see the um how it's uh, a raw edge and it's nice clean stitch great stitching you can see the stitching pattern for the interior pocket which i guess i didn't show you on the black one because you can't really see black on black but now you can really see the interior so it has a organizer lining to put your things in securely with a really cool zipper trim. And then what I like, it has this one 
one pocket compartment right here. And it does not say the S zone in here, does it? No, no, it doesn't. Interesting. This one doesn't have the branding on the inside of the tote. It's just a leather tote. There is actually no branding. This is the epitome of quiet luxury. Zero branding anywhere other than this label that comes off, you know. But this is a fantastic bag. Look at the, you can see the nylon strapping on the leather strapping. I love this bag. This is, you know what, my sister's not getting this. Mm -mm, no, she can buy her own. Yep. She can buy her own bag. This is my bag. You know, I love this. This is my $10, $15. I don't remember how much I paid for this bag. Um, this is an awesome bag. And it's from the S Zone, which I support and love. So, um, you know me. And when I found them on Timu, I couldn't believe it. But I know the name of the company. It's not the name of the brand is S Zone. The name of the company is Penny. I think when you get shipments from them, it says Penny. P-E-N-N-Y. And, um... So when I saw that, I am, oh, I have more than three things in here. But here's my other S-Zone item. So this one I bought for me. Now this one they do, um, now I don't know if those totes are on their actual website. Uh, but this I know is on their website and I've seen it on their Amazon. This, this might be one of those, we need to clear these out. Or they're coming out in style. One of the totes they gifted me actually is on Timu. And I'm so happy they gifted me one because I would have just bought another one because it's so cool. But, you know, whatever. Um... So this is a travel wallet, and this one actually says the S zone. Um, so it's a. I really thought that was pretty neat. Now I don't have anything like this. I don't carry wallets like this, um, so I don't even know if I would actually use something with cards right here. I don't know. I honestly don't know. Um, and then on the inside. Um, is now this is where I'd probably put my my cards and it's like a, it has a, a long strap and it's this is leather uh, folded and then stitched it's really pretty um, oh I think there's two straps with that so this has a place for pens um, I like this part it has a nice not the most ex luxe experience but this whole thing was $16 this is not and it's still leather um, well, it says it's leather. It looks like leather. The finish out could be better. But again, $16, I'm not complaining. I think this is for the wristlet strap that's in here. This is a wristlet strap right here. And then I think you're supposed to... The totes are a better buy than this. This is just okay. This is not my favorite. And then you can just carry it like that in a pinch or you can carry it with the strap i i bought i'm sorry the strap um i bought this to go to disney i might be carrying this i thought it would be a good um, alternative to i have a disney wallet already but i wasn't quite sure i'll take several things to disney it's not going to be like oh one wallet no it depends i change my bags to the situations i'm in so if i'm going to be traveling and going to the park day um, then I will be, um, using something like this because I want something that's going to be on my body, um, pretty secure and not easily, uh, I guess, rummage through. I mean, people don't normally rummage and, and when I go to the parks, I'm not in line or anything like that because I don't do rides. So I, I'm actually in a scooter, mobility scooter because of my mobility issues. If you've been to Disney World, that place is huge. Um. And so I don't do rides, but this would be perfect, even the length of it, because I'll wear it more like a bandolier, more in the front. It could be a little longer on me, um, but that's a me problem, not a bag problem. And um, I'm not too fond of these, the quality of the strap, to be honest. I probably would just, hmm, I might not use the strap at all. I have some other straps that are way better than this. Um, I'm not impressed with this wallet. Now the tote bags, absolutely. This costs more than a tote bags, by the way. Um, I think this was $15. I'll have to double check. That seems a little high. Um, do I love it? 
Not my favorite. Not my favorite. Am I going to use it? Yes. Am I going to... Because, I mean, just because I don't like the way it looks doesn't mean I don't like the way it functions. And the way it looks wasn't why I bought it. I bought it for the function. So let me pull up this um, Timu order. And um, let's take a look-see. And... Do, 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 do. Your orders. And delivered. And that was delivered today. So I got four items. So this was $15. The black tote was $13, the red tote was $11, and the next thing I have in this is about three and a half dollars. The next thing I have in here is for my niece. This is the last item in this haul. I think this might be the last gift I have for her coming in the mail. Um, she's, believe me, between me, her mother, her grandmother, she has everything this, and it, well, I was really worried about this too because I didn't know. Um, this is um, Karomi, and this is actually branded Sanrio. So this is actually a Sanrio item sold by Timu, and um, or sold through Timu, and it's just a, a little pen and pencil case, and that's for my niece because she loves Karomi. She's okay with Hello Kitty, but Karomi's cooler. Um, so her mother bought her this t-shirt from um, Hot Topic, and it had Hello Kitty, and and when she showed her daughter, her daughter was like, oh. And and her mother said, you know, little girl, I can't take this back if you don't like it. And it was expensive. And the little girl uh, and, and little um, Violet said, no, 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 I'll wear it, Mom. Because she's, she's nine going on. Is she nine? Yeah, she's nine going on, like, ten. So, yeah. So she's um, in that, point, that age group where... It has to be what she really likes, you know? And I was like, Jen, she's just like me. I was like, yeah, I know. Because I used to do that to my family, too. I'm like, uh, there was no lying. There was like, oh, can I have, do I have to have that one? You know, I was that kid. Yeah. So anyway, I don't know. I could return this. I have no idea. Let me actually, let me look at the details. Let me see what it says in the listing, what it says about this, the one thing. Um, oh, you know what? This is why I bought it. It's a woman's travel wallet, RFID blocking leather wristlet clutch. That's why I bought it. Because my wallet is not RFID and my cards are chipped. So I was like, no, 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 I do need this. And this says, it's it comes in several colors. The company is P-E-N-N-Y-Y. -Y. That's the company that is the um, S-Zone so let's look at the materials. Oh, this is fake leather. Okay, this one's fake leather. I didn't feel like real leather. I'm like, this feels weird. So weirdly enough, the thing that cost the most was fake leather. But you know, here's the thing about small leather goods. It's deceptive. People are like, it's just a little wallet. Why does it cost so much? Do you know how much work goes into making even this? Even this? Look at all the slots. Okay, slots, you say, well, that's just slits. But all the sewing and layering of and the patterning of having to put this together um it's still very difficult so the rfid blocking technology is in this lining back here um and honestly if you have a wallet that doesn't have it what you can do and i have not done this is in your regular wallet if it has a wallet if you have a wallet like this and it has a back pocket or something just put a slip of um tin foil that's all it is but did i do it no did i go buy a wallet because it already had it in there yeah i did because i didn't want to put a piece of tin foil in my wallet but i'm sure somebody out there will use that tip um so this is really this is i am going to switch into this and use this for the park because i i forgot because of my um chip technology and my cards i don't want to be skimmed especially since we're traveling um so my cool disney wallet will stay right here at home how sad but you know here's the deal when i go to disney world Orlando I don't wear my Disney gear I wear Bucky's because everybody loves Bucky and if you don't know what a Bucky is look it up and yes it's true we all love Bucky I wear a Bucky's t-shirt at Disney and people talk to me they stop me and talk to me I wear Disney everybody has a Disney t-shirt on so when I'm in Florida I don't wear Disney merch I wear it in Texas and when I'm in you know vice versa so when I'm in Texas I do wear Mickey Mouse. Full. I do wear Bucky too. I mean, I'll be honest. I wear Bucky. I told my friend like every Bucky's I go to, I buy their t-shirts because they're different for different locations. And now she's doing it. And her husband who works with me said, Jackie, thank you for telling my wife 
about the t-shirt thing. Now every single Bucky's we stop at, she buys a t-shirt. I'm like, I'm so sorry. <laughs> so anyhow, thank you for watching my um, Timu video. Hopefully my friend who doesn't watch all my videos doesn't see this because this is her gift. So if you are watching this and you see that black toad at Christmas, pretend you love it. If you don't and already know, just pretend. I won't remember. Anyway, have a great day. Bye.